you're really lucky, my friend, that I've just eaten. Now go, but don't mess with me again, or I will make a meal of you. Hello everyone, it's me, Usaid, your English instructor from English Story Every Friday. Right now we will cover the meaning of some vocabularies, so I need you to pay attention. Number one, laughter, the act or sound of laughing. For example, as we approached the hall, we could hear the sound of laughter. Number two, roar, to make a long loud deep sound for example she looked up as the plane roared overhead above her head in the sky number three swallow to cause food drink pills etc to move from your mouth to your stomach by using the muscles of your throat for example because she's a bad swimmer she goes under and swallows a lot of water. Number four, spare, to not hurt or destroy someone or something. For example, they asked him to spare the woman and her kids. Number five, stalk, to follow an animal or person as closely as possible without being seen or heard, usually in order to catch or kill them. Jaw, for example, he had a strong square jaw. Paw, for example, the dog hurt its paw. Robe, for example, a sailor threw a rope ashore and we tied the boat to a tree. Net, for example, you have to hit the ball quite high to get it over that net. Trap. For example, the fox got its foot caught in a trap. Number seven. Generous. It's an adjective. It describes a person who's willing to give money, help, forgiveness, etc. Especially more than usual or expected. For example, a very generous lady. Number eight, princess, a member of a royal family, especially a daughter of a king or queen. Once we covered and finished the new vocabularies, let's move to my favorite part, the riddles and the questions. Today we have three questions and I'm personally waiting for your clever answers in the comments below. Question number one. Mary's father has five daughters, Lulu, Lily, Lolo, and Lala. What's the fifth daughter's name? Can you guess? Question number two. Three men dive into a swimming pool. Only two got their hair wet. How is this possible? The last question, what has no weight, but if big enough, it can sink a ship? It's sincerely my pleasure watching me to the end. So don't forget to click on subscribe button, the red one. Give me thumbs up, have an awesome day and bye for now.